What is up, for the muckers? It's Saint Matchbox, aka Glenn, bring you another episode of Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time. So last time we were here, we beat the Water Temple, we kicked the boss's ass. So yeah. But and today we are going to acquire Din's fire and the fire arrow because at the in the story how you get it is when when you beat the water temple you shoot an arrow to the sun and um it drops down but we weren't standing in the right place so we try again and we get it and it's awesome and it's fun. So this sheik teaches us the um, prelude of light, I think it was. But yeah, so to get Din's fire, we're gonna do that first. You have to be a kid. And that involves putting the master sword back in the altar, I guess. Anyway, see you. Look, you are looking so cute. Oh, you are, you are. Right. So to get. Dan's fire, we need to go to, um, you need to be a kid because you gotta crawl through a little hole and, um, it's, new. it's, like, the, like, where you went and infiltrated the castle, that, that place, it's near there, so, uh, I mean, you'll, you'll know how to get there. So it's day here, and then... It's, oh, fun. Yeah, so you go this way. Yeah, see? Like, it's like we did what we did first. Uh, we went through the castles. And you gotta go up those vines that we went by. Yeah, see? There we go. And these vines suck. I'm not gonna lie. See? go up there and then jump down and shit you know all this I mean you did this before but yeah so you can see a rock right there and you jump down which doesn't hurt you at all for whatever reason I see a rock there it is you throw a bomb You can crawl through that hole, and then there's just like half naked. I'd say uh, four or five, maybe six, depending on what mood I'm in. <laughs> uh, so you get up on here and you play Zelda's Lullaby. Oh, wrong note. You suck. Yeah. yeah. I can't, I, I'm not gonna try to sing it. It's too early for this shit, man. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I woke up at 8 and... Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, I mean... So. 4 through 6, I guess. Milf. What the fuck am I even talking about this? God. Yeah, so, so she's, I am a great fear of magic. I will give you a magic spell. Please take it. Okay. <laughs> we will. See, look. Oh, it's red. You know it's cool. Yeah, see, look. Dance fire. Yeah, this fireball engulfs everything. It's attack magic you can use with C. So, you can use Din's fire not only to attack, but also to burn things. And so now you can come back here and heal yourself if you, whenever you want, which is pretty cool. Yes, nice, yeah, that's nice, that's nice of her. So, it was like, as usual, it was like, dude, I'm trying this shit out, man. It's just, see that? Ah. 
And the view. And it kills that sign. Because that sign disrespected our mother. So we were like, hey, fuck you. You know? So this episode is about 17 and a half minutes long gameplay wise. I'm probably I'll probably end up being closer to pretty close to 18 once we uh, finish. Well, when, yeah, once we finish putting in all the titles and whatnot. But also, what I said last episode is after the water temple we're gonna be getting the bigger on sword that will happen it's all recorded I did it already and I'm just, I'm just waiting to uh, but getting dense fire and them um, fire all were in one episode yeah, so it's nighttime and time doesn't move when you're in places like this I don't think but as you can see, there's a bunch of dogs. Like, see, there's one that likes you and is all like, Hi! Can you, can you be my friend? And it's, like, so adorable. And you're like, oh, I feel so bad leaving it. See, look, it's following you. And it's just like, it's like, okay, I'm gonna go. And you can't leave when it's nighttime. So that's kind of stupid. But, um... I see the dog still following you. And she's like, oh, can I, can I be your pet? And he's like, I wish you could, man. I wish you could. I wonder if there's a, like a side quest for those. I don't, I don't if those are just like there. Oh, it's barking now. Which kind of sucks because barking is annoying as fuck. But, <sighs> um, yes. Yeah, so, and we don't know the sun song, so we can't make it daytime. I think we learned that with the Shadow Temple, which is next, actually. We actually, like, do that at the end of this episode. Spoiler alert. Yeah, see, we don't know the sun songs. No, he's like, where the fuck is it? It goes right there. The last white one. Yeah, so I was like, wait, it doesn't need to be nighttime to go to the Temple of Time. I mean, it doesn't need to be daytime to go to the Temple of Time. <laughs> Do you remember RuneScape? I, that's really random, but I was just like, for whatever reason, the this town and the guy is like reminds me of it. I'm just like, so these 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 are stere stereotypical high school couple who basically dry hump on the lockers in the hallway, and it's oh my god. They're freaking everywhere. I mean, they're like fucking making out at lunch like it's like oh i haven't seen you in like an hour oh my god oh yeah it, it's, it's it's quite unnecessary if i do say so myself and i'm like i'm sorry doggy can't do anything <laughs> oh my so we're back in the temple of time are we the oh yes what the, what the fuck no don't go that way there okay uh, so now we gotta get turned back into an adult to get the fire arrow Yep, see, look, there's the Master Sword right where we left it. Ganon didn't steal it or anything. Sweet. <laughs> and bam. Oh, look. Freaking blue light everywhere. Oh, 
we still got to do more. I, 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 I don't like the fact, well, I guess I, it doesn't really, you know, I'm just gonna, no, it's, no, I'm not gonna say it. We changed tunics like these next couple episodes like five times. I have no idea why. I guess oh, here might be a good idea to do it. Who knows? Right? Serenade of water. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna play that. So we can uh, go ahead and get that fire arrow. Oh, look at that! It's night time. How convenient. And so now we're gonna stand on that pedestal. Because if you don't, you don't get the fire arrow. So we're just uh, hanging out, waiting for nighttime to end. So, um, oh, this is today's Christmas Eve. So, Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays. If you don't celebrate Christmas, uh, come on, son, hurry up. I really should have cut this out. <sighs> oh well, whatever. Yeah, I'm actually going out to my grandmother's and I'm staying overnight, apparently. So, yeah. I don't really want to. But, oh, look, there's the sun. Um, er, what's that thing in the distance? Fuck. Is that... Is that like a crow thing, or is... Oh, see, look! There they are! Yeah, stare into the sun, kids. Always. It's an, it's like a uh, freaking gold casing. Or no, what gold? No, red casing. You got the fire arrow. Set it to sea and arrows will be powered up. If you hit your target, it will catch fire. How about that shit? So, yep, green because the OG Link is green, always in green. That's the classic, that's the best. And where and Apona can't do bridges. Apparently, it doesn't doesn't like doing bridges because <laughs> it's just over there chilling. So it's like, oh, you know, I uh, wanna. I'm gonna say next time. Haha, no. And it's kind of random, but I freaking suck at shooting arrows with uh, while on the horse. Like it's kind of sad. But anyways, um, yep. See, there's a pony right there. It's like I, I'm not too comfortable with doing the bridge thing. Just saying. That's okay. That's okay. And he's like, oh no, no big deal. I'm just gonna stick my head. Yeah, see. 
see. Not good at all. Anyway, so now we're gonna... We got the fire arrow and the dense fire. We did everything I was gonna say we were gonna do in this episode. But we are also going to start the whole shadow temple thing. And what I mean by that is we're like there's this whole big cutscene where this thing is getting the well, there's fire, there's death and destruction, and it's pretty dark for a kid's game, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Hell, the whole shadow temple is like and So Epona can only jump over that. Like and I almost get dude, but then I'm just like, oh, fuck you, man. We have seven arrows left, that's not good. Anyways, so, the whole thing is sped up, but you can still see what happens. Um, this thing escapes, and it's all like, so, you have bigger on sword. So, once I get that whole thing finished up, I'm just gonna do the shadow temple, and then, so, yeah. Down, 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 down. I'm just gonna say this now, but bigger on is a kind of a pain in the ass. It was like, oh, it's raining. It's like, oh, they're chic. We're gonna go be like, oh, what's up? Get back, Link. What the fuck? And oh no, chic's like, oh my god. And it's just like going that way. And it kicks your ass. Looks like you're coming around. Only like, terrible things happen. The evil shadow spirit has been released. And uh, the bottom of the well. The force got so strong, the seal broke. Shadow temple. So beneath the graveyard, teach the melody. We learn a new song. And it's kind of creepy. So that's basically it for this episode. Thanks for watching, and have a nice day.